Hi, my name is Nick Eschner with Advanced Fire Protection and Safety out of McHenry, Illinois. And today we're talking about the concept of a flow switch in a wet pipe fire sprinkler system. As you can see right here in our video, this red box is your flow switch. Uh, if we were to take that cover off, which is a couple screws that are undone by an Allen, you see the guts of it. A lot of times you're going to have both high voltage and low voltage in uh, going into these systems. If you can see uh, across here, you'll see both the low voltage to your left and the high voltage to your right. The way this works is there's a paddle that goes across uh, basically the wet pipe uh, riser. Uh, and when there's a flow, the paddle goes up, which creates the alarm. You can also get an alarm if you were to drain it, which would cause the paddle to go down. So anytime this paddle is not in center, you're going to have an issue. Uh, as you can see right here, this is the indicator uh, for that paddle. So that has to be perpendicular to the pipe uh, to get this reset. Without that reset, you will not be able to reset your fire alarm.